Good morning and welcome. Let me get that out of your way. To morning coffee. It's good to be back. It's been a week. I've been working long hours. Uh, I've been training this week, so it's good to be back uh, on doing uh, shooting some some video for the channel. So uh, long week, long week. I didn't work Monday. They started me on Tuesday. And like I said, I've been training, learning all the company uh, policies and procedures, um, doing everything uh, from driving to loading, unloading, what we do at the different stops and stuff like that. And I just came downstairs. We went out to breakfast this morning and did a few things. And uh, I um, wanted to write a thank you note to Mel. I could email him. I could text him. Uh, all sorts of things. Let me move this camera over just a little bit. I can email them and text them and everything, and uh, it, it'd be quicker and I could get everything to them. But I don't want to do that. I want to make this personal. So, um, as you know, I've been using fountain pens. This is a Kawiko. It is from Germany. Sorry about the camera. Every time I move the camera, I can't figure it out. Um, and uh, I have a couple other pens I'll show you. And I've been working, uh, working those. Uh, practicing my writing and stuff like that but uh, first I want to take some coffee huh huh shameless plug that's cool just black of course and later on I'm gonna take the pipe out and I'm gonna <laughs> shameless plug so anyhow good coffee I'm drinking Lavaca it's from Torino Italy uh, it's a medium roast coffee it's pretty good um, the description in the description link there will be a thing for the mugs I now have the mugs on up for sale I also have stickers that say light them up kind of written like that with the lettering I, I kind of like this lettering the way this is uh, it's how I it's why I chose it and I like these coffee mugs these remind me of the old um, diner coffee mugs that's what I like about them um, so I'll put the link in the description box as to where you can get those mugs I'm also going to be doing uh, a limited edition Bearded Welshman. Uh, I think I'm just going to do a coffee mug. Um, I, don't, I don't know if I'll do a sticker or t-shirt. Probably just going to be a coffee mug. It's going to be a limited edition. It's only going to run for a certain amount of time. And I'll put it up when I do that if you're interested. And you would like to get a coffee mug. It's the Bearded Welshman or you can get one of these. Uh, it would be greatly appreciated. So I don't mind plugging that. Because the stuff that I work on is stuff I put out there. But anyhow. So I'm writing this note. And you can see my handwriting if this focuses. How my handwriting is with this. It's almost like a calligraphy pen. Not quite. Uh, but the Kawiko pen. This is a German made pen. It's a nice pen. It's real short. You unscrew it. Put it in there. The cap helps me with the counterbalance and the weight with the writing. Which I'm finding all makes a difference. This is like a medium nib, so it's a medium point. And then I went and I bought a cross pen. I bought this at Office Supply Store Staples. Um, nice little pen, same thing. Um, it probably writes easier without the cap on it. And I hold my pens like this, okay. So this is a more of a heavier, uh, where's it at? As you can see, the top line, that's the Kawiko. Then there's the cross point. And then this one is the uh, my rosewood. It comes in it's from Golden State Inc. It comes in a nice, nice box, nice wooden box. That's my rosewood. I like this pen. This is a really fine point. It writes really nice. You can see the bottom one, Renee, my name is, that's the rosewood. This is a slower writing with the uh, cross pen, because I want to sh show you how thick you can make it. If you write slower, it, it takes long, uh, lays a thicker layer of ink out. And then something that I started doing is I started journaling. So I write things that go on throughout the day um, on here. And it's really cool. My dad had a journal. And after he passed, we found some of his older journals. And as you read through them, it's really cool. He shared about his day-to-day -day things and what was going on. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool. But uh, anyhow, 
just wanted to uh, get on here and share with you take these glasses off put my regular glasses on but uh i'm excited uh about this weekend coming up february 2nd the weekend of february 2nd i received my press pass for the great american outdoor show it's a sports show in harrisburg here at the farm show complex it is billed as the largest sports and outdoor show in north america so they get uh People from all over the world that come in, vendors that set up, out, outfitters, hunting guides, fishing guides from all over the country. Uh, some of them are from Africa. Um, and then you get the celebrities, the hunting celebrities down. Lee and Tiffany Lukoski from The Crush. Um, Jim Shockey um, from Un Uncharted. Uh, Michael Waddell, the Bone Collectors. Um, Phil Robertson will be there this year. <clears throat> and then you have local celebrities. We have a local outdoor show, PA Outdoors. And they'll be there. And then they have just, you know, other stuff. But it's just neat. It's different than the farm show. But it's just as neat, I think. Um, and it's great. And even if you're not into hunting and fishing and stuff like that, it's just a neat thing to take your family to. So I'm excited for that. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you. Um, so that'll be my first official on the road with john williams because i'm gonna do some interviews and take some videos and stuff uh out there and hopefully enjoy it here's some banging around i think my wife's out on the back porch and dropped something but uh i was watching mike rose channel this this week this weekend and uh actually this morning and he had some pretty good stuff on there Mike Rose from, of course, Dirty Jobs, and he's had an interesting life, uh, and he shares some stuff. He calls this thing called the Sweat Pledge, and it's about hard work, and, and don't look at a, a bad job as a bad job. Look at it as an opportunity, which is phenomenal to think like that, you know? Um, how many times do we look at bad jobs and we hate them and stuff? And he looked at it as opportunities, and he shares some stories. So I'll put a link to his channel. To that video that particular video in there i think he, he's he's a big advocate for the trades for the handcrafted things for the getting your hands dirty and uh, he's been traveling the country and sharing his story and he's got a foundation that helps uh people pay for um, going to trade school and stuff like that and it's just neat but i'll put that in there but anyhow uh, thank you for your time i appreciate you coming on here with the coffee morning and talk that's all i have to say uh, get your mugs light them up drink your coffee black cream sugar it don't matter if how you like it is that's how you like it that's how you drink it but uh, these mugs are on there i'll put that the link in the box i'll put a link in the great american outdoor show in there for you too that you can check it out um, i'm sure there's going to be videos somewhere uh, that you can look at them, but I'll put together. It's going to take some time. I'm going to need to edit everything down. If I get a lot of video uh, interviews, if I get a lot of shooting done, um, it's I'm probably going to take. It's going to take some time to edit it down. I want to do it right, and then I'll put that up. I'll I'll put that episode up, and probably if it's long, it's going to be a two episode deal. Um, but if it's not too long, because I don't like to go over a half an hour with some of the things, then it'll 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 be one. But anyhow. Thank you very much. Enjoy your day. I will see you all tomorrow morning for scripture reading. We're in John chapter 11. So join us here for the scripture reading tomorrow morning. Uh, I hope your day is good. It's a beautiful sunny day, cold out in Pennsylvania, but I'm excited to uh, be home and be in my study and do the things I love to do. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow morning.